Hello again YouTubers and uh, today I'd like to show you a recent purchase from a local model shop uh, it's actually called Grimy Times we've taken over from uh, Harry from uh, Railway Junction Harry's recently retired anyway let's have a look at this little shop I bet you think he reminds you of someone doesn't he and uh, I'll have a look in a minute. Now underneath it says DCC fitted. Now this engine isn't DCC fitted now. Uh, the uh, the new proprietor of the shop he discovered a fault with this one and uh, the chip inside was faulty so he's rewired it so that it's just simple DC which uh, suits me fine actually. Now uh, underneath it's got let me show you this diagram here there's your six driving wheels and there if you can see are the electrical wipers the six there it's like an insect on its back isn't it now five of these were doing the job and they, the sixth one wasn't so I needed to unscrew these parts here and just bend that remaining wiper so I've got all six doing the job but apart from that the, ch the chap had done a great job but this model you don't believe it how many screws and parts go into it this diagram is actually for Thomas there he is and uh, his face mechanism he's there and all the parts related to that but this uh, little Stuart hasn't got that part there but he has got everything else and the motor is in this housing there which is screwed to the body it's not screwed to the chassis all these parts are then screw to this lot afterwards very tricky to take apart because there's a third screw there which you can't see until you take this part off it really is a jigsaw meanwhile the wires go straight through from the pickups right through to the motor right so there you go <laughs> what a little assembly honestly not like you're trying one screw and two lugs nothing like that <clears throat> well here we are the mystery is uh, solved for you look at the mouldings on these two <laughs> very very similar obviously Stuart on the right hasn't got a face or the mechanism to work the eyes turn him round you can see the back here Thomas got a nice smart white lamp but Stuart has just got a little lamp bracket so they are different the two differences there underneath you get a different uh, coloured running plate for Thomas but uh, really they are very very similar And uh, these have got the mainline uh, medium size couplings on. Actually, Stuart had the narrow one. And uh, just for my little testing purposes, I prefer this medium size one. So I've just swapped them over. You just screw them on. And the front, there is a difference if you have a look there. Obviously, Thomas has got that white lamp. But... Thomas has also got those two little, uh, what would you call them? Little uh, stanchions there. And they, they almost look as if you can put a coupling on there. Maybe you could, but as soon as you put a screw in there, I bet it would uh, split them. But, I don't know, you see. Um, Stuart hasn't got those pieces on. Just uh, thought this, uh, I'll show you that difference there. Okay then, let's see Stuart in uh, a bit of action then.
Oh, that was like that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, do you know you want to be on camera? <laughs> Let's see if Stuart can give you a train ride, shall we? Hold on tight. Okay, thank you Stuart, very nice. <laughs>